tried to get in, but they told me, no, you can't come in because there's been a bad shooting. Back up! Back up! No, I'm not working out. I'm working the scene here. There's big old shootout that happened in Lauderhill at the Spot Lounge and Grill outside of it. Well, what it looks to be. Look at that whole mountain sea of yellow evidence markers where all those bullets were fired by a wicked gunman. The parking lot's over here. And this is as close as I'm able to get because we don't want to hinder the investigation of the crime scene. We got exclusive access into this gym and we can actually take a real good peek at all the major crime scene that has this whole plaza shut down in Lauder Hill. No, this plaza has been pretty cool. This is like the first time we had a serious incident like this. So um, overall, everything is good over here. What's your a shooting in this part of Lauder Hill? can't be. Sadly, one man was killed, and another one was injured. This all happened at 3.30 in the morning outside of Spot Lounge. We can't say if it happened in that lounge, but it happened in the general parking lot. We spoke to a man who owns this business right here, Maurice Brute, he calls himself. When I came this morning, I saw these police cars. I'm like, oh, what's going on here? Uh, I tried to get in, but they told me, no, you can't come in because there's been a bad shooting. As you can see, a whole bunch of crime scene tape, Lauderhill police, homicide detectives, crime scene investigators walking the whole perimeter, working very hard and diligently to get to the bottom of who pulled that nasty trigger, lusting for blood. And they have SS coming in, they can't walk up front still because they still have everything taped off, gotta respect that. University Drive and Northwest 44th Street, near the Crafty Crab, the Wawa, that's where it's all going down. We don't know what really took place, but some say a fight, bad moment, a bad blood beef in between two men or more took place and then a whole bunch of bullets started being fired. Since 3.30, it's right now, it's close to 9 a.m. and the police are still out here, investigating. Inside the spot lounge, we definitely know that a lot of bullets were fired outside of that area. Okay, so in that parking lot, you can see so many Lebanese markers. Hell, you can even see some in front of the spot lounge and more behind that white van. It's a whole bunch of right now crime scene investigators, a lot of, a lot of police, detectives are going back and forth trying to figure out what in the world happened. Well, anyways, we're going to keep you up to date with all that details, but you got to stand by. All right. So I'm the breaking news reporter right here in Lauder Hill. Be careful, stay safe. I'll see you good people next scene. Thank you. This is your news recap. Boom, boom, boom! Of all the wild, brutal, craziest stories from the state of South Florida. Oh, For real? Like, oh, like that? We're 1800, dog. Get the family together. Sit down because you're gonna need some heavy drinks. Back in the 5-6. Hold on, hold on. Ducky Taco. Follow for more local breaking and action news only here at Action 55 Community News Reporter.